represents a potential starting reagent in the retroactive synthesis of that target molecule. The term was coined in 1967 by E.J. Corey. He noted in 1988 that, quote, the word synthon has now come to be used to mean synthetic building block rather than retrosynthetic fragmentation structures. Because synthons are charged, when placed into a synthesis of a neutral form is found commercially, instead of forming and using the potentially very unstable charged synthons. The term is also used in the field of gene synthesis. For example, 40 base synthetic nucleotides are built into 500 to 800 base pair synthons. Many retrosynthetic disconnections important for organic synthesis planning use carbocationic synthons. Carbon-carbon bonds, for example, exist ubiquitously in organic molecules and are usually disconnected during a retrosynthetic analysis to yield carbocationic, cationic, and carbonionic synthons. And heteroatom atom bonds, such as those found in alkaloids, can also amides also be traced backwards retrosynthetically to polar CX bond disconnections, yielding a carbocation on carbon.